Reports suggest the hybrid version of the upcoming Aston SUV could pack a punch. According to reports, the hybrid powertrain in the upcoming Aston Martin SUV could pack as much as 700 horsepower. The car, which is set to wear the Barakai badge, was initially intended to be Aston's first all electric car, but with the revived Lagonda brand now looking to go down the electric route. Those plans have been shelved. Instead, the car, which will differ dramatically from the DBX concept, pictured, will come with a range of gasoline and hybrid options, the latter of which is being rumored to deliver around 700 horsepower. We have the capability to do an EV. But the plan right now is gasoline and hybridization, Aston Martin's CEO Andy Palmer told Car and Driver. We see a path that enables us to conform with CAFE regulations with its hybridization, he added, referring to the strict U. S regulations. According to CND, the hybrid drivetrain could make use of AMG's Viturbo 4. Zero liter V8, which produces around 500 horsepower, while an electric motor could add a further 200 horsepower. As well as the resurrected Lagonda Mark and the hybrid SUV, Aston Martin's electrification plans include an all-electric Rapide, called the Rapide. The car will be based on the high-performance AMR variant of Aston Martin Super Sedan, but the 6-liter V12 engine will be ditched in favor of an all-electric powertrain developed and installed by the Williams F1 team supplied engineering division, Williams Advanced Engineering. Meanwhile, the company has confirmed the first new Lagonda will be an SUV that will arrive in 2021. Few details have been revealed about the car so far, but it will feature styling that's an evolution of the Vision concept that was shown at the Geneva Motor Show back in March, 